Well, so from my point of view, when we're addressing prevention, just from that perspective, we need an IFM every year because the continuous education of our colleagues that are at the front lines of prevention needs to happen. So there's always new data coming across. There's always new research coming across. There's always new science that is extremely valuable that needs to be delivered in some mode or some venue. And this to me is an ideal venue for primary prevention. Well, cardiovascular disease is gonna to continue to be a huge burden globally. So I think we won't veer away from prevention, prevention, and prevention. Uh, however, there are other topics, as uh, you saw earlier and post my discussion, on other disease states that we could use a lot more education on in prevention because new uh, modes of uh, detection and monitoring are coming alight, like continuous monitoring of glucose and so on for diabetics. So I think we can broaden that scope of prevention to other modalities and other disease states, but in the end, I think prevention is key for this population. Thank you.